Assaulted? Yeah, pretty much. Remember, he... Wait, wait, wait. He can't move! I was like, I thought you were just like a... You know... A, a cuddly... Bear that... No. Fake bullets, but those are shotgun rounds like multi... He fucked her up so <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Licorice Recoil, and in this channel, we have a tradition where the season finale of anime series, I suit up, but still, <laughs> no pants. You know why? Because this is a hobby, not a job. What happened last episode? It's seemingly, we're gonna get a good outcome. Everything is looking pretty good until the scene with Majima at the end, where we kind of... Uh, Chisato was about to go down the elevator, and there was like a backpack. It's like, no, our backpack, we gotta get the doggy tag that Takina kind of gifted us, right? Majima's right there. So it's gonna be like a Majima versus Chisato thing. But what about the heart? Shinji fucking has, like, scar marks on his chest, the center chest, where it's, it looks like he might have inserted the second heart within himself for... I don't know what, for Chisato to be able to kill him to get the second heart. I think it might be a bluff. I think that the second heart is in the suitcase, and he got away, but, but, somehow, I just don't think that this is gonna have a bad ending. The show from the beginning has been so bubbly, so positive, even though we're just killing, even though, like, right off the bat, we started, like, killing people, right? We just saw licorice agents just, like, shoot random people, like, terrorists in the act, right? But it was all bubbly and positive, and the tone and the music, everything points towards a happy ending, and I refuse to believe there's gonna be a bad ending. My guess is... I think Majima might actually end up helping us, M might end up help us get the heart. I don't know how, but it just makes him feel like he's not really the final boss or the villain. Good and bad is relative. There's a great line, and maybe we can convince Majima to help us be like, hey, you like, you know, Chisato's are really talented. You enjoy, you know, battling her. She's gonna die soon, so why don't you help us get the heart? I don't know. We need to fucking get Shinji, though. I hope we get the third case, and we're gonna get a happy ending. First half of the episode, it's gonna be just getting rid of, get, getting to the happy ending. Second half is just gonna be fun, bubbly theme. Likureko opens, everybody's having good times. Takana and Chisato is wearing cute cosplays as usual, and that's why we're gonna end the series. I, I hope, I hope. That's why it's today's episode. Recoil of licorice. Hey, that's a title drop, the licor licorice recoil, right? It is over. What do you want? What do you mean? Roboto. One hour until self-explosion? Okay. Is this Act 4? How many acts did he have? Like, Act 3 or 4? <laughs> I- <laughs> Look how laid back she just like, come on, get it over, but I gotta get my second heart. Oh? He reached her? Let's just have to handle it, basically. so crazy how she can still dodge. Like, I know I've seen this multiple times, but every time that happens, it just reminds me of, like, Ultra Instinct in Dragon Ball Super, where Goku just, like, walks, and, like, energy blasts from, like, Topo and, like, the other people are coming, and he just, like, casually walking, just like, come on, dude, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? Do I a grenade? Relax! This motherfucker is just so obsessed with explosives, man. But like his hearing, a grenade at that distance doesn't do anything to his like like advanced hearing. Last time we shot right beside his ear and we were able to like you know distort his uh his control. The heart. Oh, the battery's out. No. Oh, we're at the end of the line. The twenty-five. Huh? Drink break. Take a little break. Yeah. Okay. What is she? Because if he really wanted to end it, he would end it. What does he want? I feel like there's a reason why Majima isn't finishing this and why there's this end scene with Majima and Chisato right now. I really, I really hope that Majima ends up saving Chisato somehow. He's still here. I thought he escaped a way further Takina, give us the fucking suitcase. No? Who is... Meek! Give us the suitcase. Give us the heart! Assaulted? Yeah, pretty much. Remember, he. Wait, wait, wait. He can't move! 
I was like, I thought you were just like a, you know, a, a cuddly bear that, no. Fake bullets, but those are shotgun rounds, like multi- He fucked her up so <laughs> I don't think I've seen Mika that emotional ever. Other than the, you know, the elevator scenes with Shinji. Yeah, what the fuck was that like? He could just pit, he put all the force onto that leg. That was just a fake out the entire time. This fucking guy for this one scene. He was faking being a cripple for 13 episodes. I'm down. No, you would. Would Mika really kill Shinji right now? He's crying because they're probably old lovers. It's heavily eluded, but please, the second heart. What is the second heart? Please tell me. But we didn't see it. No, no, no. We didn't see it. We saw that. We saw the shot, you know, the impact, but we didn't see if it landed or not. Hey, this is the opening theme. And usually when the opening theme is playing in the season finale of an anime series. Like it's it's like we're about to win theme, right? That's what always happens. They do vibe kind of well though. Like Majima and Chisato like this. Oh Jesus, that was only six minutes. All right, break time. So casually just reloading on our right, break time. Though let's go back to shooting each other. Can we really stop it if we have that phone? Takina, catch the phone somehow. What if we just shoot the phone? So there's one minute left. Takina! Oh. Wait, 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 where did that land? I see blood! No, she actually got hit! No, Takina's gonna catch the phone, right? Takina, where are you? Oh no, she got shot in the back! Yes! Save her one more time, please! <laughs> Give me my happy ending! Oh? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Are we all falling down? Remember, there's only one minute left till it blows up. Where did you. Headshot, but he's still fine. Okay, stop the explosion somehow. Oh, PTSD, like back in the old days, round one. Oh, what the fuck? All right, we can save her like this. Okay, good, good, good. Kind of worried about Majima, but I'm sure he'll be fine. That, that guy will never die. Ah, oh. But aren't we still in the radio? This dude, it was a fucking fake out. We got nice fireworks, really? Okay, well, why am I upset by this? We just got baited, but. We're gonna get a happy ending, but the heart. No, no, we still need a heart. <laughs> Mika has the heart. Mika definitely has the heart. We're gonna come back. We got some nice fireworks. I'm sure Majima is safe somewhere. Mika has the heart. We're gonna get a happy ending. Wait, that looks like a Chisato, doesn't it? Whoa, 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 whoa! Stop shooting at your best friend! That's her, it's her, it's her! Look at her, it's her right there! So casually, you're shooting fucking actual bullets at me, but... Aren't they trying to hit each other while tied up? <laughs> oh. We're getting our happy ending. We're getting our happy ending right now, right? But like, I want to know the status of her heart. What's going on? Are you okay? Like... Of course. Wana doesn't care. Oh, you were just happened to be in the background of the picture. Wait, this is how this series started, with like a screenshot of but then the arms deal was in the way in the background. And now we're finishing it off with Chitato being found in the background like this. I believe this is called like a book close. I'm not sure. So did you get a search? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is she still alive? Tell me. The heart? 
Explain, please. Mm. Hospital room. Second heart is so. <laughs> she just so she just ran away. Like that. So I guess Mika really did get the heart somehow. I don't know the status of Shinji because Mika shot at Shinji, but we didn't get to see Shinji get shot. We just saw the app thing, the, the the gun go off and the and the fucking impact of that. But was the heart really in Shinji or was he bluffing or was it in the suitcase? Don't know. We're here to get you back. The briefcase, the heart. Happy new birthday, meaning, you know. How long is this heart gonna last, though? This dude actually just faked being a cripple the entire time just to fuck that girl up. That's so funny to me, man. Also, did I just miss that? Did she just throw away the owl, the owl and owl, meaning, you know, she's moved past, you know, the institute, she's moved past Shinji. Now, we can just have happy Yuri moments again like this. We're having our happy ending. Just chill. Just go on vacation. Just, just hang out. Go on cute dates. Wear f cute things and eat nice things. Who cares? Post credit scene. Oh, I think she just said enjoy us in like English. Oh, boss? Uh, Mika's busy. Oh, we're running like a little food truck in like Hawaii right now? <laughs> the other way around. He's like trying to practice Japanese. He's like, no, I don't speak English. He might have just also spoke English. Hmm? What's going on here? Hello. Are we in trouble? What's going on? Hello. Aloha. I don't really know what's going on with this guy at the end, but hey, it looks like we got our happy ending. Everything is fine and dandy. And it looks like we're kind of setting up for season two. I know that this is like, a, like an anime original story. I don't think it's based on a manga or like some kind of light novel, right? So I think it's highly likely that we will get a season two Maybe, but at least they've kind of foreshadowed like things are gonna things are not done yet, right? We have the other missing guns, Majima is still away, you know, the boss is still calling us, there's gonna be a second season, and we still have the Lily Bell that kind of showed up in the you know the end of the arc, but I'm sure there's more to do with that. Chisato is fine. I fucking knew it. I fucking I was gonna be so sad if they went with a bad ending. And if they did, I would have respected the show a lot, but I'd be depressed. But I didn't imagine if they fucking set us up with like 12 episodes of bubbly happiness. Well, it wasn't really 12, it was more like nine or ten till when we got to learn about Chisato's heart. And then at that point I was like, no, my weekly just happy vibe anime is turning into a fucking melodrama. But it was necessary to give us some kind of like some kind of stake, some kind of just like an emotional clutch for us to kind of feel something. That it doesn't just always just be, you know, like a happy vibe show. Because now, when we do get the happy ending, it's even more better. Man, fantastic anime. Just been like, the pacing, the animation, soundtrack, everything was just like fucking fantastic. I don't think there's anything I could possibly shit on the show for. Like, it was just so well-rounded and came out of fucking nowhere. So, I'm really glad I watched it. But hey. If you stick around this long, if you do enjoy my reaction, you already know what I'm gonna say. Thank you for watching Licorice Record Me. It's been a fantastic season, and a new anime season is along. A new anime season will drop within the next couple of weeks, so I hope to see you then. Until next time, guys, take care.